Hi guys, welcome back to Food Frenzy. We're your new hosts, Maddie and Marina, and today we're trying holiday drinks and desserts. Yeah! yeah. Latte, but can I have oat milk in it instead? Of course. And then one of the spinach feta and egg white wraps. Alright. And do you guys have any pumpkin spice stuff left or no? We have. Yes, we do. Uh, can we have a tall pumpkin cream cold brew? You said a pumpkin cream cold brew? Yeah. Alright, what else? That's it. It's gonna be 1943. Okay, thank you. I really want like a lot. pickle, but they don't have pickles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, unless we want to go buy a jar of pickles, we just Let's have to deal with them. <laughs> okay. Um, pumpkin cream cold foam. Pumpkin or cream. Pumpkin cold foam. <laughs> cold brew. Whatever pumpkin it's called. Cream, pumpkin cream cold, cold brew. brew. Cold brew. <laughs> <laughs> the cold I, foam is orange. Yeah, that one's like I'm my favorite. Uh, like fall drink. I'm gonna put this in my it door. Smells like pumpkin spice. It like is. <laughs> the presentation at Starbucks is my favorite. Yes. Um, 13 out of 13 for presentation. This is a peppermint mocha. It's an iced one. Yeah. And it has little chocolate swirls on the top. That one, I would. I think an 11 out of 13. Yeah, I think it's, it's very like, simple and minimalist. Yeah. But still like cute. Yeah. You know? She cute. She. You know? she She's simple. She basic. She's okay, okay though. <laughs> Alright. I'm excited for this one. Me too. It has sprinkles on it. Sprinkles? Yeah. Oh. Sprinkles. Here, take, take. Yeah. Okay, okay. 
pink. Um, I think she's pretty swag. Um, she has sprinkles, like we said. You call it a mukbang or a mukbang? A mukbang? <laughs> I call it a mukbang because that's the right <laughs> way. that's what it sounds right. Honestly, I'm gonna give it like a 3 out of 15. Yeah, it's, it's cute, sad. but also like, like that's, I can't the even see this. Right. There's like literally two sprinkles on top of it, and that's the whole presentation. We got mini cups for this. Yeah. Oh, wait, pour that out of the cup. <laughs> yes. Okay. Oh, there's sprinkles on the bottom. Really? Yeah. Pour me some. I'm just gonna drink out of this one. Okay. And then you can have that one. Wow. I see how it is. Okay. <laughs> two, one. Okay. Oh, that's it's not what I thought it was going to taste no. like. It's different. So, but like not bad. The coffee taste is not strong at all. I just feel like, <laughs> like, I was like, mm. it's, it tastes almost watered down. It tastes like something I have tasted before, but I don't know what that is. No. It's, it's creamy though. It tastes good. It just kind of tastes vanilla. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Not great. Oh well. So I give it 7 out of 13, maybe. Yeah, I'd give it like a. Yeah, probably 7 out of 13. Just because, like, I don't know. I had really high expectations for it. Yeah, me too. I was excited to try this. Mm -hmm. Maybe it'd be better in like a frappuccino. That's what I'm thinking. Also, you can't get it hot. So it might be better hot too. Yeah. It tastes kind of like the cupcake cappuccinos from. Yeah, it reminds me of like a sugar cookie pop tart. Okay, so this one is the pumpkin cream over. That's what it's officially called. Yeah. So we're gonna mix in the, the foam. Three, two, one. Very coffee. Very strong coffee. It's because it's cold brew. Yeah. It. I don't taste much pumpkin, not gonna lie. But yeah. Look how smooth it is because smooth coffee is good coffee. Excuse me. Anyways. Okay. Alright. So I give this a mm, 5 out of 13. <laughs> I didn't give it a 9 out of 13. <laughs> I'm not a fan, not gonna lie. Really? I like it. So, next we have a peppermint mocha. An iced peppermint mocha. Yeah, I'm excited for it. I like peppermint mocha, so. I wonder if. Hold on. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I wonder. Do you think if I just flip it, it'll work? Just pour it. I think it'll be fine. It smells very pepperminty. Does it have a straw? Use your straw. All right. Three, two, one. Oh my goodness. That is very strong. <laughs> I like it. I like it too. It's just overwhelming. Yeah, giving very much no coffee though. Yeah, I can taste it a little bit, but it might be from like cold brew. I was about to say, is there even coffee in this? Yeah, it's a mocha. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. It's look like, like you love it. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind you went. <laughs> okay. I mean, what was, I was gonna say was it's kind of like grainy. It's weird. Grainy? Yeah. Like, you can... It's thick. You can, like, feel it on your tongue. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I don't know. I like it. I give it, like, an 11 out of 13. Um... I give it a 10 out of 13. It's a little strong, but still pretty good. Last but not least, we have our spinach and feta wrap. Yes. It has egg whites in it too. Oh man, they didn't cut it. Um, Normally they cut it in half. It's okay, I'll rip it. <laughs> Before you throw this in the comment section. Come <laughs> <laughs> on, what? There's like a thick egg slime. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
Oh, it was egg in it too. <laughs> really? <laughs> I didn't notice. It is pretty good. Yeah, I've never had one of these before. I don't usually get food from Starbucks. Sorry, I'm talking with food in my mouth, but still. Yeah, so I give this a... I give it like a 12.17 out of 13. Yeah, I think so too. I was gonna say 12, but that's, yeah. <laughs> I think if they had like tomato sauce, not like tomatoes, but like tomato sauce. That could also make it good. Yeah. Thanks for watching this episode of Food Frenzy. If you enjoyed, like, comment, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And, We'll see you next time. Yeah. Bye. Bye. <laughs>